What's going on everyone, my name is Tom Bobadillo, and welcome back to some more Pokemon Brilliant Diamond. So, after our disaster of an ending last episode, I have gone to the underground and caught some more Pokemon. But, we have to say goodbye to our Graveler. And, unfortunately, our Kadabra. But we also now have a Badoo and a Hoot Hoot, which I'm kind of happy about the Hoot Hoot. Uh, along with our Luxray and Napoleon. I also have a Wingull. He seems really weak. So I'm going to hope the Hoot Hoot evolves. And is stronger. It's got some good moves. You know, I haven't checked Voodoo's moves. Wow. Nothing. Okay, so he's useless until he gets some moves. Well, good thing he's not useful in the Steel Gym anyways. Because I believe this is the Steel Gym. So, today's goal is to get the Ryolu Egg. Or Lucario. I don't remember if he comes in an egg or not. I remember in the first game, in the original Diamond and Pearl, I do believe Lucario was an event and you had to get a ticket. To even get out to the island. Yeah, is there even anything useful here? Okay, so this is pointless. Great. I'm hoping there's no, like, special things I have to do to evolve Hoot Hoot in a Nocturne, Noctale. Uh, let's go see if we can find the boat. Who's this? Okay. Uh... Okay, that's all you gotta do. Now the fun part will be finding where in the world in this cave Lucario is. Because I don't remember exactly what you do to get to him. First of all, we're going to be in a cave, so... I'm only focusing on money because I'm just going to go buy a ton of the uh, things that can increase their IVs. And just, like, make everything absurd. Okay, I don't really want to fight anything random. I don't have any super repels. Oh, it's right there. Okay, so this is only useful to get to that item. We might come back to that. I mean, there's a chance it's like a really cool TM or something, I guess, but... Well, that wore off fast. Okay, well, I guess I'm just gonna have to fight that girl. Because it looks like I need to get to that elevator.
Okay, here we go. Picnicker. You know, I don't want my water right there because my PS5's right there. Does Napoleon ever learn any ice moves? I really want him to. Why do we seem so zoomed out right now? Ghost has no effect on flying. Really? I actually didn't know that. Surf should definitely be powerful enough to kill this. Surf's OP. That's the, uh... I don't think water is going to do that much, but we'll just do water again. Yeah, that's not very effective. That was a critical hit. So it definitely wasn't very effective. That will be super effective. Yeah. Okay. It didn't go up above half, so Brine will do double damage. I love having Brine. A critical hit and double damage. Plus our stab bonus. That's a good stack right there. I should just go fight the people in the restaurant over and over again. Because they seem to have the most money. Okay. You know what? We'll go left again. Hi, Riley. Okay, so I guess it's something that you had to do. Yes. Honestly, I'm just trying to see if there's any cool TMs down here. Okay. Well, I don't really care about doubles battles, so I'll kind of, I'm willing to do those. So one has three, one has two. Oh, Onyx will one-shot them. I mean, Surf will one-shot them both. I don't think Surf will one-shot his Lucario. Ah, eh, screw it. I don't care. <clears throat> Sorry, Lucario. That should be like double XP to one-shot both in a f one move. Well, I'm going Surf again. Lucario should survive. He says I'll keep my Pokemon healed. What does that entail? Is he just going to heal me after the battle, or...? Will Badoo evolve immediately when it levels up? That's what I really want to know. I feel like that should still be a one-shot, yeah. We're gonna find out. I kinda hope it does, because I really want Rosilia. Actually, I really want Roserade. Aw, oh, 
on, no. What do I have to do to get Resilia? Grass Stone? Dang. That's just a max HP thing, right? Double wild battles? Oh, his list. Is everything healed? And he restores my PP of my moves, too. Surf all the way, baby. I'm gonna, like, super. I'm gonna get, like, a crit on Lucario and kill him or something. Aw, he survived. What kind of bullcrap is they both get sturdy? Is that if we move at all? Or is that only if we... Switch Pokemon. Because technically, that's a special attack. I didn't move, so I shouldn't take damage, right? My critical hit ratio must be really high. Okay, we're gonna put on another repel. I'm already sick of this. This would be fine if I was trying to level up a baby Lucario, but I'm not. I have four repels. That's basically as long as two super repels. These are two Ace Trainers, I believe. Yeah. Pelipper and Ponyta. I don't think Pelipper's strong. I think it's just like a tank. I'm just kind of tanky. But I might be wrong. I don't remember. But we're just going surf again. Yeah, I knew Pelipper would survive. That was a crit, too. Wow. Yeah, tanky. Well, it's probably not very effective against Pelipper, right? Because I think that's water flying. Thanks a lot, Lucario. Ghost is super effective against Ghost. Lucario, I'm going to rely on you to kill Pelipper. I have faith in you. Use a move besides Force Palm. Oh, my nose is itchy. I actually don't have anything for that right now. But I can one-shot that one. Oh, you attacked first. Interesting. Ooh, I might kill Lucario. Yeah, I killed Lucario. As long as he's below half, I can kill him with Brine. Maybe. Swift is a weird move. It's one of those, like, guaranteed to never miss moves, right? Okay, there's Hoot Hoot. Ooh. 
Ooh, come on, Noctail. <gasps> Noctail! Yes! I love Noctail. I love owls in general. Who who has two legs? I actually didn't know who who had two legs. No, because we're right here. Does Riley even have another Pokemon? Like, if I kill Lucario, mind my own. I think I am. Guess I should pick my moves carefully then. Because they each have three. There you go, Lucario. Start pulling your damn weight. <laughs> okay, I think I'm gonna pull out Surf here. Because I, I don't like Krogunk. I always get scared when Krogunk's on the field. There's no way it blocks that. Yeah. <laughs> Who did you plan on attacking with that? There was no one there. Yeah, we're going surf again. Just to clear out the... Golbat. Or was that a Crobat? Golbat. Okay. We actually didn't kill the Golbat. Interesting. Good job, Lucario. Good job. 43. Almost 38 for Badoo. I always want to say Bidet. Like a, like a Bidet. <laughs> it's Badoo. Where am I? I want to do the old trick that just lets you run around in the circles. I want to rubber band my controller together and just run around in circles all night. I used to do that all the time on my DS. Are you going to evolve? Nope. I don't know when you evolve. I want that Pokeball. Maybe I do need a Grass Stone. Or a Leaf, leaf Stone. I don't really care enough to kill you. I just want to get out of here. So you could go back in and go the other way. 
don't know if that gets you anywhere, though. I don't know who that works on either. Noctail got a lot of, uh, you know, actually, let's look at his, um, stats now that he evolved, because his stats weren't great before. Oh, okay, he got a nice little increase. Let's, uh, compare him. Badoo's still a little low, but he has two evolutions to go. I just don't know how to get those evolutions to happen. I mean, he's a little on the lower side, but his move set, Moon Blast, a fairy move. He's got Dream Eater with Hypnosis. I mean, those two together are like unstoppable. It all just depends on whether the Hypnosis works or not. I want Badoo to evolve before I decide who I'm going to give the HP up to. Because I kind I like my party right now. I actually have Pokemon that I want to keep. I don't know what I want to do before the gym. Because I really want Badoo to level up. I just don't know how he levels up. You know what? I'm gonna, look. I'm gonna look it up. Just because I feel like normally if I had caught a lower level one, he would have just leveled up as we were going. But I don't know how it works for this. But do evolution. It evolves into Roselia when leveled up with high friendship during the day, and then I can make it into Roserade with the shiny stone. Sweet. Okay. I actually didn't know what the shiny stone was for. So that's actually really good. I don't know what to do to make him happier, or... In is there a way you can see friendship level? I thought you used to be able to see friendship level. I don't understand the point of that app. I don't know what that is. I don't know how long I have to walk for Ryolu to hatch either. So I don't really know what to do right now. I mean, do I have anything that's good for this gym? Fire. Fighting. And ground, I believe, are what's good against this gym. So, I mean, I really need Lucario.
I have a drain punch that no one can learn. I have rock. You can learn rock smash, but that's such a low level move that it's not helpful. I don't think anyone here can learn... You know what I should go catch? I saw it before in the underground. We need to fly to the other side of the map. We're gonna go underground exploring for a little bit. There's hound dooms, hound doors, in the underground somewhere. That would be perfect for this gym. Where am I? I think it'll be in the next section over, not this one. But we'll check this one too. A Psyduck. Graveler. Oh, I'm stuck. Chokes. We can reset a couple times. I don't know if there's any rooms that are specifically fire. Oh. A Munchlax. Interesting. Lots of barrels, or however you say their name. I don't know what the odds are of Houndoom appearing. Also, I don't know how to get to certain sections of the map. The bottom left he won't appear in. That's not the right style. I don't know. And Absol... You know, I won't say no to Absol. I like Absol. I don't know what moves I could teach him that would be helpful. Could he learn any fighting moves or fire moves? Please do not kill it. Please do not kill it. Thank you. Unfortunately, I have to hit it again. Please don't get a critical hit. Please don't get a critical hit. That's fine. I'm completely fine with that. I don't want to use a Premier Ball. Ultra Ball. Yeah, okay. Let's check his uh, IVs and movesets. Ooh, really good basic attack. And a, and a high crit hit ratio. Nice. You have slash and night slash and faint. Okay, what are you? Dark. Can you learn a fighting move? Ah, you can't. Ah. What good are you? I mean, what are the odds you could learn a fire move?
Okay, I do like having him. Mainly just because I like that Pokemon. I think he's cool. There's a Benary. If, if I catch a Benary, isn't there someone I can trade it to for something? Or show it to? I don't remember where that's at. Or what I get out of it if I did it. It's just like a game of luck. Oh, jeez. Geodude, a palm, binary, a lickitung. Okay, let's go to a new area. Get away from me. Head this way. I wish I could use my bike down here. If I get out of here, we want to go down. Pacharisu, shop. I was not paying attention. Reset this room once and try. Try again. Get away from me. Okay, we'll keep going. There's got to be like a fire room or something. Volcanic Cave. Ponyta. Now this is the kind of room I can get behind. I can't catch Ponyta because I've already had one. I don't know what Skaroopy is. But we will reset this room a bunch. Fire Room. This is what we need. Oh, foot cramp. Um, yep. Oh, foot cramp. Oh. Well, I know I can one-shot you, so... Oh my god, my foot. Okay, that... Why was that... Oh, because I'm part steel, so I lose my uneffectiveness up from it. That sucks. So now it does normal damage. What kind of Pokemon is Skroopy? I hate how you stick to walls. That just traps me in a tornado, yeah. Too bad it won't last, because you're dead. I need to get, um... I just need to fight with Badoo. It's phrases friendship. But he knows no moves. Like, he literally knows no moves at all to fight with. Okay, so we might try to catch a Skroopy. 
if it's part fire. Okay, um... Onyx is not fire. I guess we're in a volcanic cave, so rock too. Oh, there it is. For the love of God, let's not kill it. Is that the evolved form or the unevolved form? I'm very scared of what to use. Strength. I'm fine with that. This is what we needed. Nope, we're gonna sit here and throw Ultra Balls at it till we get it. What does that do? I'm scared. Because I don't know what that does. Yeah, oh my god, thank god. I don't know what Destiny Bond does. That scared the crap out of me. What does Destiny Bond do? Ooh, okay, okay. Not bad speed. Good special attack. You have a fire move. After using this move, if the user faints, the Pokemon that landed the knockout hit also faints. Okay, so I was hoping I would kill it. So it doesn't matter, because I wasn't going to hit it anymore. Oh, so if this was... If I had a full party, that's not a bad move. Okay. We're going to go by... What's the stronger dark move? We're going to go by two fire TMs. And give him to Houndoom. I am. That'll be. By the next time, by the next time I make another video, we'll be ready. For the gym. Okay. Yeah. Sorry, Absol, but you're going to have to come out. I love Absol. He's so cool looking. He reminds me of, like, a non-legendary Arceus. But unfortunately, that's useless. Oh, actually, we're right here. We'll go ahead and buy our TMs. At least one. I believe it's the third floor. We're not buying the ones that's like leaves a chance of me getting burned or anything like that. Yeah, fire blast. No. Flamethrower. This one. I can... Oh, no. Oh, Fire Blast does not leave me. It's with the target with a burn. But I think it only has a 90 accuracy. I think that's the downside of these. I think they have lower accuracies. Yeah, 70. Also, only 5 PP, 85. 
not worth it. That's 90 for 100 accuracy, 15 PP, that's fine. I don't want Solar Beam, I don't want Psychic, I don't want... Did she give me Dazzling Gleam? Is that the one she gave me? I have none of them. And, uh, seems like Nocturne can learn them, so let's buy one. I kind of want this. And I kind of want to buy this for Luxray. I already have good electric moves. I'd like one good ice move. Now you just sell ones that are... That's a bug move? That's a bug move, interesting. I have that. Bulldoze wouldn't be bad to have. So I would have a ground move with someone. We're gonna go buy a few of all the different stat raising items. Was that you? That was you. So I have one HP up. God, no. We'll buy two more. I don't care too much about defense. Let's go with basic attack. We'll get four of those. And we'll get four of these, too. Go ahead and buy one more speed. Because that's something I can give one to each Pokemon of. And be helpful. And this is why we're using Amulet Coin. I really do want to go back to that restaurant and just kill everyone. Multiple times. Uh, where was that even at? If I went... It was here, right? It was right here. I just need to go straight down from here to get there. Yeah. Okay. So I'll just save right here, because I think I'm going to go do that to farm some money. And get some levels for Badoo. Actually, yeah, let's... One last thing. Can we teach him to do any moves? Because I'd really like him to learn something. You can learn Bulldoze. That's awesome. Yes, you can learn Ice Beam. Oh my god. Oh, Noctel can't learn this. But Badoo can. Well, heck yeah. That's a super strong fairy move. Well, that gives him one decent move. I don't know what Fairy is good against. But it gives him something. He can learn Shadow Ball. Wow, a lot of them can learn Shadow Ball. That's a strong ghost move, too. We'll hang on to that. We'll see who gets what kind of stats later on. Yeah, he can learn Grass Knot, which means... 
I mean, for right now, it might not be the worst thing to teach him. And Bullet Seed. I guess we can go with Grass Knot. If it's a big target... I mean, he needs something that can do some damage. That just kind of sucks. I'm just really surprised he can learn Ghost Ball. Shadow Ball, whatever. Too bad I only have one of those. That's such a good move. We'll have to see who gets up with the best, like, special stat later on to get that move. Because none of them are part ghost, so none of them get anything out of it. Houndoom is dark fire, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. We will leave off right here. And we will pick up, back up next time, hopefully with a hatched Ryolu. And, uh... Maybe a Rosilia, because I have to level him up during the day, apparently. But uh, that's going to be all for today, so thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please smash that like button, and don't forget to subscribe. And I'll talk to you all next time.